There is new blood in the Golden Path. My husband loves to sew. He used to make clothes for the whole family. Now he... Zabal says, I shouldn't be doing this. I am teaching you to protect yourself. Ah, the tourist. I'm Amita. This is Badra. Hi. Keep working. Look, I overreacted back there. We're at war. We keep losing soldiers. The work keeps piling up. Is there anything I can do? I'm not a soldier, but I want to help. Okay. Sure. There's a farm not far from here. Kanan runs it, but she's old, and she could use your help with some wild animals. I need you to keep the hides intact, so use this. Badra. What are you... Pick it up. Try again. Very good. sent me over. She said you might have some kind of wild animal problem. Hey, Amita, I have no idea what I'm supposed to do here. <sighs> Wolves are a common nuisance for Canaan Farm. She's killed off a number of them, but this year they're especially aggressive, and I'm worried about her. There's a den nearby. Clear it out, huh? I think Kadan has supplies stockpiled somewhere on her farm that you can use. And Ajay, skin your kills. We can always use the pelts. Badra, how are you? Good. I, uh, brought you these pelts. I thought maybe you could use them. Hmm. These are good, Ajay. But you keep them. She has enough for her Tanka paintings. I'm sorry, Tanka what? This one is about the life of a guru. This one is about the demon Yalung. This one is about the goddess Kira. And that one is about Badra. The next Tarun Matara. And Tarun Matara is a living goddess, if you believe Sabal. It's no life for a child, being treated as an object, thing. <sighs> Thanks for your help. Later, I'll show you how to put those to good use. Longinus. He's a friend to the Golden Path, and he'll be grateful you helped us. Longinus, you said? Yes. He's a weapons dealer and a priest, if you can believe that. Longinus is a little crazy, but if you want guns, he's the man you should see. I'll update your map. Longinus. A 
You! You are AJ! Welcome to my church! Away from church! That sells guns? Of course! Well, the meek shall inherit the earth, my friend. All they need are some good guns. Revelation 5.5. 5. It is the most invigorating read. And one of the elders saith unto me, Weep not! Behold the Lion of the tribe of Judah, the Root of David, has prevailed to open the book and loose the seven seals thereof. Uh, it is I... our savior. It is our savior returned to us as a lion, a warrior. So, I started thinking to myself, when the son of God is reborn, what gun would he use? When Christ returns to break the seven seals and bring about the rapture, he returns as a lion, yes? A lion needs teeth. What gun would Jesus choose? Deuteronomy 3247? For there are no empty words for you, but your very life. Or maybe... Revelations 1911. The discretion of a man deferreth his anger. I don't know what you're talking about. A soldier knows. A soldier always knows. For we have seen the rapture and survived it. You need guns to do righteous work, AJ. For every gun is a Bible. For every bullet, a sermon. And for every radio tower that you free from pagans' lies, I will give you something. A reward. It is the will of God. Here. This is for the first one. Vanderport is under attack! We need fighters here Sabah, now! what's happening? We're under attack! Stay away! Oh, shit! We say to them, go forth into all the world and proclaim the gospel to the whole of creation! Let's do this! 
Jade, get her out! I'm all right. The people need to see her. It'll comfort them. She's just a child, Sabal, and she's terrified. I'll take her home, and then we'll worry about the people, okay? Thank you. You're okay. <laughs> this is what we get for rescuing Ajay. We hit Paul's house, he slaughters a village. This isn't on Ajay, it's on me. We can't worry about that now. They took the outpost, and they have hostages. Fine. The outpost first. Without it, we're cut off from the others. 